Good morning, guys. It's 8.30. 8.30 exact. We are at... Excella Health. Uh, Ashley is getting checked out for her concussion today. Um, since her wreck, she finally... Some stuff happened with her place of employment and they need her to get checked out and all that shit. It's a big mess. I'm not going to get into it. Um, I just want to say, you know, thank you to everybody. Sorry, I'm listening to Sirius Satellite Radio right now. A little bit of crossfade in the morning. I haven't heard this song in years. This is old crossfade, so far away. Like, I haven't heard this song in a long time. I was probably in, in high school when I heard this song last time. Actually, I know I was in high school. Because, uh, yeah, this is just a... It, it, yeah, there's a story behind this song, and yeah, I'm not going to get into it. But, uh, I just wa I want to say thank you to everybody. Um... You know, you guys are, uh, I never knew whenever I first started this whole logging my life thing would get me even this far, and I'm hoping that it'll get me a lot farther, um, but with that being said, yeah, I made it to... To log the mirror and the experiences that we were having and all this other crap. But I and and to get help, you know, because it, yeah, I've had experience I've had a lot of paranormal experiences before. A lot of stuff that I just I cannot explain. I've talked to people who are professionals and they can't explain it. So, yeah, it's it's disturbing stuff. Oh, seven dust. I love seven dust. Denial. I love this one. But, um, I. Something that I've always wanted to do is I've always been a uh, yeah I've always been a person who is very big in my opinions hence the American flag stuff you know my my opinion is my opinion nobody is going to ever change that but I'm also somebody who, you know, I'm not going to sit there and say that your opinion's wrong. Everybody's entitled to their own opinions. But with me saying that is, in my opinion, and my stuff that I've seen, I know that there's evil Good, good and evil in the world. Um, and obviously, a lot of people don't know that or don't believe that. They just they don't believe in good and evil or heaven and hell and blah blah blah. And I'm not going to get into that because that's just not my place. I'm not I'm not a minister. I, I don't go to church. I wear a cross, I have a cross on my arm, I have a bunch of blessed shit, but I don't go to church. I'm not a church-going guy. My grandfather is an ordained minister, for grace sakes, and I just don't go to church. I don't believe that you have to go to church and get baptized just to believe in God, or be able to follow God, or, or be, you know, blessed by God. If you, if, if the Bible is right, we are all descendants of 
God and or Jesus and God and, and, and all this stuff anyways. So why do we have to go to church to and get baptized to be blessed by God if we are all supposedly descendants of him? You see what I'm saying? <laughs> Anyways, um, that's really not what this video is about. I'm not getting into religion or politics. That's not my place. Again, I don't like to do that because I don't like... Again, my opinion's my opinion. You're not going to change that. You're entitled to your own opinion. I'm not going to change that. But we can talk to each other about it, opinions. And, you know, I, I just don't like to fight about it. I, that's childish shit right there. Like, you know, don't, don't belittle me because my opinion's different than yours. I hate that. That's why, that's why me and my, my grandfather, who is my best friend, differ a lot. Because I have my own opinion about stuff. And he thinks that a lot of the stuff that I say or do is, is bad or just because he doesn't do it or see it that way, it's wrong. And I hate that. But... That, again, that's not what this video is about. This video is just me wanting to say that something that I've always wanted to do in life is help people. I love to help people. Um, and that's actually what this is a good song too, Three Days Grace, right? I haven't heard this song in a long time. I love this station. This is that that. Uh, XF, uh, SXM Turbo uh, Channel 41 on on Sirius Satellite um, ow. I like it a lot because it's like the 90s and 2000s music the shit that I fucking grew up with the actual good stuff <laughs> you know I'm not saying that there's not bad or not good music out today or new artists that are really good i like i prevail i love i prevail uh that band fame on fire i love them they're fucking awesome but a lot of the music nowadays i just cannot stand it i got a wide variety of music i, I like obviously rock i love you know uh, how the hell oh there's a road that goes down there Okay, I was wondering how the hell that car just passed me twice. <laughs> but, uh, I, yeah, anyways, I, I love rock, obviously. Um, you know, punk rock, uh, uh, rap, hip-hop, uh, country, you know, it's the old country. Except for Luke Combs. I love Luke Combs. Luke Combs is, is he's the man. I fucking love Luke Combs. But, um... Yeah, I, I just, I, I want to help people. I want to, if, if you're having a bad day or are going through some shit, like, and you need somebody to talk to, like, I'm, I'm, I'm that person to talk to. Like, I love just trying to help people out, like. If you're having a bad day, you need somebody to vent to, like, I will sit there and listen to you. You know, if you're having a very, I'll make another video for this, but a very touchy subject is depression and ultimately, unfortunately, suicide. And that is something that is kind of heavy with me uh, because I've had attempts in the past and um, I, I, again I'll make another video about that you know but ultimately like if you're anything you know paranormal uh, depression uh, you know uh, trouble at home 
you know, if you're, you know, a, a, a pissed off teenager, you know, I, I, I get it, dude. I've been there. I'm 31 years old. I'm going to be 32 in June. You know, I went through the whole depressed teenager stage. Like, dude, like, I dated somebody. I was fucking 14, 13, 14 when we got together. And I was I 18, 19 when we broke up. Like, and it was... A big mess because they moved a thousand miles away and we still tried to stay together and it was a giant fucking mess like I live just south of Pittsburgh PA and they moved to Orlando Florida like bro that it, that was fucking hard like I didn't know how hard it is you know especially when you love somebody that much and all you want to do is just be with that person you know, now I'm, you know, I'm happy that stuff happened the way it did because obviously I wouldn't be with Ashley now if it didn't happen that way, you know, but I had to go through some jacked up, fucked up, terrible stuff in order to get to where I'm at now. But with that being said, I also have my problems with it. Um, whenever I was 11 or 12, I found out that my, my dad isn't my real dad. I was adopted. And after 31 years, I finally got to meet my, my biological father. And he's, he's actually cool as shit. He's one of the coolest dudes I ever met. Like, he's, he's me. You know, that, that's, that's me. You know, you ever want to know what my dad looks like? Like, Bro, picture me with long, dark black hair. Like, literally long, pinned straight back and a ponytail all the way down. Like, down the middle of your back. That's me. <laughs> That's my dad, bro. Like, I got to meet him. He's cool. He, he was in North Carolina for how long? And just out of nowhere... He, my, my neighbor and him are like best friends. Like they grew up together. My, my biological father used to live on the land that I live on now. And it's been three generations, three generations of me <laughs> living on that land. So that's why, like, I'm so big on not leaving. Like, when I actually just found this out, obviously, like, within the last couple months. Um, and, you know, finding that out that, you know, my land is, you know, been in my name for, you know, my, my dad lived there, his dad lived there. And now I live there, you know, we're trying, I want to keep it in the name, you know, I want to keep it in my family and eventually build onto my house and all that stuff once it's completely paid off, which it should be paid off this year, I think, I can't remember, but anyways, like I said, I want to, I want to help people, like, I want to be able to travel the world to help people like that is my ultimate goal and that is one reason why I started this page so but anyways like this this video is just kind of me babbling a little bit I'm gonna make another video because I got so much time right now like I said my fiance is in there and like her appointment's supposed to be like almost two hours long. So, and I've only been sitting here. I don't even know if she went in yet because her appointment wasn't supposed to start until like nine o'clock in the first place. And we got here damn near 45 minutes early. So, yeah. So, but yeah, I'm going to post this video. I'm going to make another one. And I'm going to tell you basically exactly what I want. Like, 
I said I want to help people. That's not even the start of it. Like, I want... I want to be able to make this world a little bit of a better place before I die. And I desperately, desperately need your help to do that. But again, I'm going to make another video. So, I'll hit you guys up in a couple minutes. Later.